say goodbye to the hassle of showing your ID and boarding pass multiple times before you board. Air Canada is rolling out a facial recognition pilot project to confirm customer ID. The feature matches a scan of your passport's photo and chip with selfies to authenticate identity. Available for select flights departing Vancouver as well as the Air Canada Cafe at Toronto Pearson. No, I don't think I'd be willing to do that. I prefer going through all that, even though it takes a bit, you know, a longer time. I prefer keeping it the old way. I'd be down for that. Yeah. Canada's transport minister applauded the project in a joint statement with the airline, saying it has great potential to make gateboarding easier and faster while maintaining strong safety measures. Aviation analysts say this type of cutting-edge technology is already being used around the world. This is the future. You're seeing the future of air travel evolve. Digital ID is optional and the airline says biometric data is encrypted and stored only on the customer's mobile phone for up to 36 hours. But questions remain about what's at stake for users. This is very personal information and is it safe, especially if it's used by a private company as opposed to being run by an immigration services at a border control, for example. Ontario's former privacy commissioner says you need to be cautious with your personal information. A lot of people saying, well, what the heck, the little privacy loss, what's a big deal? It can be a big deal. I've seen so many cases of identity theft and other compromised um, cases where your information is used for unauthorized purposes that come back to bite you. Kavukian is calling on Air Canada to be transparent about how the information can and will be used. Air Canada referred Global News to its terms and conditions, which are available for anyone to check out. Anne Gaviola, Global News, Toronto.